Welcome. This is Toilet Talk, episode two. <clears throat> Forgive the uh, Jack in the Box taco sauce I spilled on my wife beater while beating my wife. Today, very special episode. I'm here to talk to you guys about where I sit while doing Toilet Talk. Now, I sit not only on the king's throne here, right, as you can see, but I have added to it an attachment. This, my friends, is the Toto Toilet Bidet. Now, I'd like to give a review of that Toto Toilet Bidet. First, I'd like to tell you guys that why I'm wearing this stained wife beater. It's a larger size than a lot of my other ones. <clears throat> so it'll hang down lower and cover the shame that I have of such a minuscule penis. I mean, this penis it is ridiculous. It's if, if I don't shave the hairs around it, okay, you can mistake it for an egg in a bird's nest. It's, it's tiny. It's ridiculous. All right, well, just my luck. Small penis, small brain. I got the whole trifecta. Anyway, trifecta, what's the third thing? I guess small balls too. But the balls are so small that it actually makes the penis look big in comparison. So thank God for that. Okay, so on to the review. So the Toto Toilet here has a lot, uh, well, the Toto Toilet bidet. They have, you know, this goes for a few hundred dollars. Um, has a few different functions I'd like to go over with you guys, and I'll try them all here. But this is stop. Nothing's going on right now, so you don't have to press stop. Here is the rear asshole cleaning, okay? Now I'm pressing it. Takes a second. Take a second. Takes, oh, there, there we go. <laughs> there, there we go. Now, this is going right into my asshole. Now, what I have kind of learned how to do is relax the hole. And by the way, I also co uh, combine it with the... Um, squatty potty which elevates your knees to give you a better full release when you're releasing your bowel movements and you're emptying out now sometimes <clears throat> I, I just use it just to clean myself even if i'm not shitting but here's what you do you relax your asshole completely like you're letting a shit just come right out of it and as you relax it the water shoots in there because it's not tensed up and it has a thing where it warms up the water electrically. So it doesn't get hot, it just gets warm. And I'm gonna get into that in a bit when I give you the final recommendation on this here. Um, the the warm water, I've, I've used bidets without warming water when it has the cold water. Cold water will keep your asshole kind of tensed up. The water really won't get up in there and clean it out real good. The warm water really relaxes the hole, creates more of an opening for the water to get in there clean and flush out whatever you kind of fart it out the water comes in you fart it out and then shit that you didn't even know you had will come out which is great because you're more clean okay you're walking around all day you don't get itchy not that you're clean okay now now it's starting to get cold because it this this particular model it holds water and a certain amount of water and electrically warms it up Okay, I'm gonna get into why I'm not a big fan of that in a second. So here, if you press it a second time, you have oscillation. Oscillation basically means the water just goes like this and it will clean a larger surface. I prefer oscillation, I do like that. But for those that don't have it, if you just kind of move back and forth, it will do the same thing. It will clean a larger area. Now, here, Instead of rear, we could also do soft rear. And this doesn't go in your asshole. This just kind of mists the whole area, okay? And you have different pressure as well. You could turn the pressure down to almost where you don't feel anything. I prefer the pressure all the way up to really, really get in there and give a good cleaning. Now this is for women only, but I will show you guys how it works. Uh, this is going to uh, uh, clean the 
uh, what's the proper way to say this? The cunt, the cunt hole. This will really clean your cunt hole. Now, since I don't have a cunt hole, although mostly, most of you will beg to differ since the penis is so small, you might think it's a vagina. But trust me, many doctors have mistaken my penis for a vagina many times. But uh, I feel it now. It's kind of spraying my balls is what it's doing, okay? Wait. Isn't the worst feeling because it's not a hard shooting like the like the first one, which is rear. It's more of just a, sp a nice spray on the balls. So I can't really review what it does for a vagina since I don't have one. Eh, kind of have a vagina, but you know what I mean. Okay, so now let's go back to rear, what I'm used to. Now there is the position. Okay, uh, I don't know if you sit further, if you sit f more back, whatever, and your asshole uh, needs to get cleaned. Uh, if your asshole is located more, I don't know why the position. Maybe because some people are larger, some people are smaller, what have you. Now, temperature. This is my favorite thing that this that this has. Okay, so you have my seat temperature. I have on high. Water temperature. I also have on high. Now, the benefit with the with the with that is. It's a cold day out. I come inside my place. It's cold in my place. As soon as I take off my pants, I put my ass cheeks down. Oh, it feels amazing. It's nice and nice and warm. By the way, that was me moving the squatty potty, not me farting. It feels nice and warm and I I love it. Okay. My favorite thing. Now, here is wand cleaning. The wand cleaning is beautiful. So if I press stop, okay, I can click this on and what it will do is it will clean the wand let's say the um uh, uh so how come i don't hear it cleaning there we go now it's cleaning so let's say i spray shit gets everywhere and it gets onto the cleaning wand well that's not necessarily the most hygienic thing right we don't want shit all over our cleaning wand so what i'll do is i'll do the wand cleaning and then we're good to go, okay? So I'm gonna click that off and then I'm gonna give you guys my review. One. Oh, there's one more button here for uh, energy saver. I don't know what that does, so I can't review that, okay? I'll tell you guys this, and by the way, excuse the little hairs here, it's disgusting, I know. Okay, this is what I'll tell you guys. Um, I have had bidets before that just shoot water and not a big fan better than nothing better than just using paper then i've had the ones that hook directly up to the cold and hot water no electricity they're actually much cheaper those are about 50 bucks this is about 300 dollars I prefer the $50 one because you can really get it hot. I'm talking hot. So hot that it will burn your asshole. Now you might think that's a bad thing, but it really gets in there and it's, and it can stay hot for like an hour. You can sit on there for an hour and steam will start coming out. To me, that's the best clean and it's the best. I prefer that over this is just warm and the warm goes away in 30 seconds. Okay. I want it hot and I want it to really go in there and clean it out. Now, that one unfortunately doesn't have the um, uh, 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 the warming seat. I have found also for fifty dollars warming seats sold separately. So, what I'm going to do in my future uh, future restrooms, I'm going to buy them both separately. Spend a hundred dollars, get the one that hooks up to the hot and cold water uh, without electricity, and then get a separate electric uh, 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 seat with the soft lid clothes, which this also has. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about here. Pull up these pantalones. Okay, so you got the soft lid clothes. See how it takes its sweet time? Oh, by the way, look at this. Look at this, you're gonna love this toilet plunger I have. It's the poop emoji, huh, huh, huh? Okay, so you got the soft lid clothes here. So that's love, the never slams. And by the way, I put, pull my pants up, and as you can see, I don't waste time wiping. Wiping is for pussies. Remember that. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed my review of the uh, 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 Toto Toilet Bidet uh, along with the um, 
the uh, Squatty Potty, which by the way, I do recommend the Squatty Potty. It's a great uh, place to sit while you shit, okay? Thank you all for tuning in to Toilet Talk Episode 2. I hope you join me next week for Episode 3. Love y'all.